staying in Canyon County, another Treasure Valley School District is moving to an online only start to the school year. Caldwell School District making that announcement last night, just 17 days before the start of the school year. And after previously saying they would be doing a kind of hybrid half day, four day sort of schedule. So why the last minute change of heart? Kim Field spoke with the district's spokeswoman earlier today. We had really hoped that we could open in yellow with kids present. But last night, with all that information, they made the decision that we are opening in red or remote learning only. Remote learning for all of Caldwell School District 6500 students. The decision not an easy one to make, according to their spokeswoman, but it was based on the level of community spread and information from area hospitals. So this really was, though, the decision was made overall for the health of, of your school community. Yeah, we have a plan and all districts do and ours we had green, you know, it's green is kind of normal. Yellow again was what we were hoping to open up where kids could be present part of the time. Or then in that situation where the community spread is substantial, how how would we respond? And we used guidance from the state, um, information from medical professionals, and the board made the decision looking at its plan that that was the step to take. Allison Westfall says the reaction from parents has been mixed, but this time around, remote learning will be different for Caldwell schools. It's going to be very different than last spring in our district. Every student will have a device. We are using some of our COVID, COVID federal funds to ensure every student has a device, and those will be distributed uh, very soon to families. And they will be working with their schools on accessing lessons, submitting work. The work will be graded, and it will count. Now, with 16 days until school starts, the district encouraging parents to be patient, but to plan on remote learning at least through the 1st of October. Of course, we're going to be watching the level of spread in our community all the time. We meet uh, weekly and more with our local health department. But they've set a formal time at the end of September. They'll revisit it. So we're telling parents to expect to be in remote through the first part of October. So with a decision being made later in September so they can plan are we going to be able to continue in remote or as we hope our community will em embrace all these prevention measures and we can get into yellow, uh, maybe green someday. They'd already pushed the start of the school year back from the 17th of August to the 27th. And as for what each remote school day will look like, the amount of time and when students are expected to be in front of their devices, well, Westfall says that will be based on grade levels. And she says parents will soon be receiving more information from their teachers. So remote learning starts for Caldwell, as I mentioned, on August 27th.